Hello everyone from Cinematic Cravings. Today we are talking about the series Agatha Coven of Chaos and New Development, and we will talk about the cast of the upcoming series. But before we get to that, if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, I would love it if you would be selfless and take one second to subscribe to the channel and like the video. So let's get started. Agatha serves as a continuation of the storyline introduced in WandaVision focusing primarily on the titular Phase 4 villain, Agatha Harkness. Played by Catherine Hahn, Agatha's enigmatic character captured the attention of audiences in the original series. And Agatha viewers can expect to delve deeper into her backstory, motivations, and her role in the MCU's expanding universe. The series reunites several actors from WandaVision, including Elizabeth Olsen as Wanda Maximoff, also known as the Scarlet Witch, and Paul Bettany as Vision. These familiar faces provide continuity to the narrative while exploring new dimensions of their characters' arcs. Additionally, Agatha will introduce exciting new characters to the MCU's Phase 5, further enriching the tapestry of the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Originally titled Agatha House of Harkness and later Agatha Coven of Chaos, the series promises to expand the mythos of witches and sorcery within the MCU timeline. As the multiverse saga unfolds, Agatha will play a pivotal role in shaping the events to come, offering audiences a deeper understanding of the supernatural elements at play in the Marvel Universe. While WandaVision set the stage for the multiverse saga, Agatha will continue to explore the repercussions of Wanda Maximoff's actions and delve into the mysteries surrounding Agatha Harkness. With its blend of familiar faces, new characters, and intriguing storylines, Agatha is poised to be a captivating addition to the Marvel Cinematic Universe, providing fans with thrilling adventures and unexpected twists. As WandaVision sets the stage for the multiverse saga, Agatha will continue to explore the repercussions of Wanda Maximoff's actions and delve into the mysteries surrounding Agatha Harkness. Blended with familiar faces, new characters, and intriguing stories, Agatha looks set to offer fans exciting adventures and unexpected developments. So let's see who's in the cast. Number one, Catherine Hahn as Agatha Harkness. Catherine Hahn debuted as Agatha Harkness in WandaVision, originally depicted as Wanda Maximoff and Vision's nosy neighbor, who eventually revealed herself to be a powerful witch. Hahn started her acting career as grief counselor Lily Lebowski in Crossing Jordan before going on to star in dozens of comedy projects, many of which earned her critical acclaim. With appearances in Parks and Recreation, Transparent, Glass Onion, and Bad Moms, to name a few, Han's experience in both comedy and drama made her perfect for a role in the MCU, leading to her bringing Marvel Comics sorceress Agatha Harkness to life in WandaVision, a role that she'll reprise in the Agatha show. Agatha Harkness is a friend and mentor to the Scarlet Witch in Marvel Comics, and while she was depicted as a villain in WandaVision, she has already been shown to be providing useful tips and tricks to enhance Wanda Maximoff's sorcery. After attempting to steal the Scarlet Witch's chaos magic for herself, Agatha was placed under a spell that left her trapped in her Agnes persona, though it seems this spell will quickly be broken in Phase 5's Agatha. Han will be joined by several MCU newcomers in Agatha, seemingly forming a new coven of witches in the MCU. Number 2 Deborah Jo Rupp as Sharon Davis. Dipper Jo Rupp, renowned for her iconic role as Kitty Foreman in that 70s show and its spin-off that 90s show joined the MCU in WandaVision as Sharon Davis. Initially introduced as Mrs. Hart, the neighbor of Vision's boss, Rupp's character eventually broke free from the confines of Wanda's hex and confronted her directly in the series finale, revealing her true identity as Sharon Davis. Rupp's extensive experience in sitcoms, including notable appearances in Kate Alley Family Matters and Friends, provided her with the comedic timing and acting chops necessary for her role in WandaVision. Her return in Agatha suggests that the upcoming series will continue to explore the aftermath of the events in Westview, further expanding upon the interconnected narratives within the MCU. Number 3 Emma Caulfield Ford as Sarah Proctor Emma Caulfield Ford known for her memorable portrayal of Anya Jenkins in Buffy the Vampire Slayer made her mark in the MCU with her role as Sarah Proctor in WandaVision. Initially introduced as Dottie Jones, the enigmatic leader of Westview's social elite, Caulfield's character was later unveiled as Sarah Proctor, 
one of the many residents ensnared within the confines of Wanda's reality-altering hex. Caulfield's diverse acting background, including appearances in Once Upon a Time, Supergirl, and Life Unexpected equipped her with the versatility needed to bring depth to her character in WandaVision. As Sarah Proctor's role unfolded amidst the series' intricate plot, Caulfield's performance kept viewers intrigued, sparking numerous theories about her character's true identity and significance. The extent of Caulfield's involvement in Agatha remains uncertain, leaving fans eager to see how her character's storyline will continue in the MCU's Phase 5. Number 4 Patti Lupone as Lilia Calderu Broadway icon Patti Lupone was announced to be joining the cast of Agatha in December 2022, where she will portray the character of Lilia Calderu. With a celebrated stage career that includes three Tony Awards for her performances in Evita Gypsy and the 2022 revival of Company. Lupone brings a wealth of talent and experience to the Marvel Cinematic Universe. In addition to her remarkable stage achievements, Lupone has also left her mark on the screen with roles in various television and film projects, including Bo is Afraid American Horror Story Hollywood and Pose. Her character, Lilia Calderu, is depicted as a 450-year-old witch and a member of Agatha Harkness' original coven, possessing the skill of divination. This portrayal draws inspiration from Marvel Comics' Calderu, who serves as the keeper of the Book of Cagliostro, adding an intriguing layer of mystique to the character's narrative arc in Agatha. Number 5. Sashir Zamata as Jennifer Kale Sashir Zamata, known for her tenure as a cast member on Saturday Night Live from 2014 to 2017, has established herself as a versatile actress in both comedy and drama. Her credits include roles in various projects such as Woke Home Economics I Feel Pretty and Moon Girl and Devil Dinosaur Zamata's comedic prowess and acting range make her a compelling addition to the cast of Agatha. Joining the cast in November 2022, Zamata takes on the role of Jennifer Kale, a significant character in Marvel Comics known for her ties to Man-Thing, Ghost Rider, and Doctor Strange. In the comics, Kale is a member of the witches a group that includes Topaz and Satana. With Zamata's portrayal of Jennifer Kale, it's possible that Phase 5's Agatha will explore the formation of this mystical team, adding depth and intrigue to the series' narrative. Number 6, Joe Locke's MCU role was announced in 2022. Joe Locke made his television debut with a prominent role as Charlie Spring in Netflix's coming-of-age drama Heartstopper, his talent, and rising star status were further solidified when he was announced to join the cast of Agatha in November 2022. While Locke's specific role in Agatha has yet to be officially confirmed, speculation abounds that he may be portraying Marvel Comics character Billy Kaplan. In Marvel Comics, Billy Kaplan is known as the reincarnated son of the Scarlet Witch and a young hero named Wiccan. As a prominent LGBT character, Kaplan's introduction into the MCU through Agatha would represent a significant step forward for representation within the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Locke's potential portrayal of Kaplan holds the promise of bringing depth and diversity to the series, enriching the narrative and broadening the scope of characters represented in the MCU. Number 7 Aubrey Plaza's MCU role was announced in November 2022. Aubrey Plaza, renowned for her portrayal of the enigmatic April Ludgate in Parks and Recreation, has been announced to join the cast of Agatha in an undisclosed role. Plaza's versatility as an actress, showcased in both dramatic and comedic roles across various projects, has garnered widespread acclaim. Her diverse resume includes notable appearances in Scott Pilgrim vs. The World Legion The White Lotus Ingrid Goes West and Black Bear. While Plaza's specific character in the MCU series Agatha has yet to be confirmed, speculation is rife regarding her potential role. Some conjecture suggests she may take on the character of Morgan Le Fay, a prominent Marvel Comics witch. Alternatively, Plaza could portray an original character created specifically for the Phase 5 series. Given Plaza's established talent and range as an actress, her involvement in Agatha is anticipated to bring depth and complexity to the series, potentially elevating the storyline to new heights. Number 8. Agatha Supporting Characters Asif Ali returns to Agatha as a Balash Tandon, also known as Norman WandaVision. His character, a friend and colleague of Vision, adds continuity to the series and hints at further exploration of the characters within the Scarlet Witch's sitcom-style reality. 
With his background in comedy and acting, Ali brings depth to his portrayal of Tandon. David Payton reprises his role as John Collins, who transformed into Herb within the Hex in WandaVision. Peyton's character played a crucial role in Vision's realization of the truth within Westview, indicating that his presence in Agatha may lead to further revelations. Known for his appearances in various TV shows and films, Peyton's return adds intrigue to the storyline. David Langle returns as Harold Proctor, the husband of Sarah Proctor, portrayed by Emma Caulfield Ford in WandaVision. With Caulfield Ford potentially taking on a larger role in Agatha, Lengel's character may also see expanded significance, contributing to the development of the narrative. Lengel's versatility as an actor adds depth to the portrayal of Proctor within the context of the series. That's all from me. For now, friends, what do you think about this cast and series? Let us know in the comments below. See you next time in other videos.